welcome to the finale of season two of Twin My Heart. It's the last day, the last episode. I don't know who the girls are going to pick and at this point, whoever they choose is going to be a great, amazing option. I'm really nervous today. I love how Ryan makes me feel safe and he makes me feel comfortable. I can just be myself around him. I love how Denzel makes me laugh and he just makes me forget about, honestly, any issue or problem I'm having. Today is going to be quite difficult for me. I still don't really know where my head is at with the boys. Dustin is hilarious. I also love that he has an amazing relationship with his brother because family is so important to me. Vince was definitely one of the guys that caught my eye right away. He is so sweet and so loving. I'm really excited that I get to spend a little bit more time with the guys before I go ahead and make my final decision. Good morning! Hey, good morning. Congratulations, you guys are the final four! <laughs> Going into today, I am excited. I feel like I have done just about everything that I can do to let Neza know who I am and show my affection for her. Right now, the ball's kind of in Franny's court. She knows how I feel about her, and I'm just excited to see how this all turns out. After last night, I'm feeling a little better. I could just put my best foot forward and hope for the best. So today, I'm feeling great. Last day, last challenge, I'm feeling good. Today's gonna be super fun. Um, so should we get ready for the group challenge? Yeah, let's all head into the kitchen. Okay. Yeah. Hey. So the way to a girl's heart is food. <laughs> <laughs> and we all love food. So today the group challenge is going to be you guys cooking something for the girls. But we do have a little bit of a twist. Of course. Aww. Of course there's a twist. Aww. What do you mean? Oh, they like cooking with their feet or something? No. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. Cooking is really important to me. I love to cook at home, so I want to make sure that the guy that I'm with loves to cook too. We are actually bringing in one of our friends. You guys may no. recognize. No him. way! He's no, the no. best cook I know. No. No. Meryl Twins decided to call me out here to, you know, surprise everybody, surprise my friends Franny and Neza, and I am so excited to be here and to meet these guys. I wanted to bring Christian back for the last episode because I want to see how the guys interact with him and maybe Christian can give them some advice about the last day. I think it's very important for our friends to get along with, you know, the guys. So let's I'm go. Ready. So I'm Christian's so ready. going to show you guys how to make the French toast. So. Let's see what your cooking skills are like. I am so happy. I know that Christian is an excellent cook, so the boys are gonna be in good hands. All right, let's go. First things first, you gotta make the batter. So when you're making batter, you got a little flour in there. I like to put the flour first just to get the uh, dry ingredients on the ground. Before I let these guys into the kitchen, I gotta teach them some skills. I wanna make sure they know what they're doing because I don't want them all to fail. <laughs> That'd be embarrassing. Got some eggs in there. It has to be three eggs. I f I'm following a recipe right now. Here's the thing. Mm. You can show off and kind of cook without a recipe and stuff like that, but showing off will get you nowhere if you make a crappy dish, you know what I'm saying? So French toast is a relatively simple meal to make. It's even deep fried French toast. You make your batter, you heat your oil, you dip your bread in your batter, I'm not gonna lie, looking at Christian put together this French toast thing, low key, I kind of zoned out and zoned back in. Pop it in, do it carefully because the oil is hot. I hope um, I do the right thing when I get up there because I really wasn't paying attention. See that? See that? Beautiful. That's yeah. beautiful. Gotcha. I have worked on a food truck before, so I feel like that's definitely gonna help me out. And then, voila. Ooh, oh, that looks good. Right? That looks good. Right? And that's how you make French toast. Who's I'm, first? I'm going first, I called it. That's my guy right there. So each of these guys have the chance to make their own French toast. They're gonna make their own batter, 
They're gonna fry it, and then they're gonna plate it however they see fit. May the best man win. Hey, Drop that egg, let's go. All right, let's on. do it, let's hey, do I it. Hey, I got a tip for you while you do this. What, what? Don't mess up. All right. Oh, oh. <laughs> So I'm first, and I already feel like so much pressure. I'm like, dang, maybe I shouldn't have raised my hand so fast to go first, because I should have learned from the other guys, but you know what? Gotta hold on tight, because this is definitely gonna be a ride. You know what I mean? Wait, wait, I wanna add some, um, some ingredients. Let's add some cinnamon, right? Let's do that. Denzel has just started cooking, and it's already a disaster. Now I don't know what to do. I'm just grabbing things frantically, and I'm just like, all right, this sounds right. This looks cool. Let's just put this all together and just stir it all up. This guy's my brother. He's family. I love him. That's my best friend, but he does not belong in the kitchen. Wait. What are you doing? This, this oh is too my. big for the bowl. Oh, man, this Oh! Oh, my God. Oops. Well. There go my tongs. Oh man, Denzel, this is awful, <laughs> dude. Denzel is an absolute train wreck in the kitchen. I want some cereal for a topping. I'm decorating with Cinnamon Toast Crunch because who doesn't love Cinnamon Toast Crunch? I'm ready. This is... Good job, bro. Look at that. All right, let's do this thing. I feel like I am gonna crush this competition right now. How much flour are you gonna add to that, bro? Any day now. I'm going. Any day now. After watching Denzel make his French toast, I decided that I'm gonna take my time a little bit more and get it right. Nice. Mm. Be careful, be careful. Ooh. Hey, ooh. 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 Okay. He's adding some sauce to it. Okay, okay. I like it. Oh um, no, he's gonna get how time to do all that. No, come here. I'm seeing that he's not putting a lot of syrup on there, so I feel like I gotta jump in. I gotta add some. Help him out a little bit. Oh my God, like that much syrup? All right, thanks. Two, one, go. All right, watch out. Spin move. And okay, right to the pantry he goes. So I really liked what Denzel was doing with the nutmeg, so we're gonna try that out. Right. I'm gonna copy, but also improve on it. Nutmeg, what is going on here? I was the originator. It's the greatest form of flattery. You did one thing right when you were cooking. Great job, man. Ryan's cooking, and he's actually doing a pretty good job. Wow. And he's a now. thick boy right there. That may be a little too cute for her, man. I will say, he looks a little uptight while he's in there. He's not having as much fun, but I mean, you can tell the guy wants to win, so more power to you. The whole Just time. Making sure. Am I executing it the right way? Yeah. Uh, sure. I heard Franny hates apples. Good thing you're putting apples on her French toast. Thanks, man. Appreciate the support. Mm. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah, look at that. All right, Dustin, bring us home. Go. Uh, let me be comfortable real quick. Okay, oh. whoa. Dustin, put your shirt on for once, okay? I don't know why every time somebody talks about anything, your shirt comes off. Dustin taking his shirt off, I mean, I already can see how this is gonna go. There are like horror stories of people cooking in hot oil with no clothes on, and this could be a tragedy. And I know Neza will watch it back later, and she's gonna be like, wow, look at that bod. <laughs> look at that bod in the kitchen. Have a good conversation. Oh, how oh, does that feel? We good, we good, we good. We're good, we're good, we're good. For my French toast, I wanted to add a little love to it, you know, and put a flower, a little rose, a little nice gesture, and hopefully she'll like it. Stop, stop. Hope you boys are ready because I love food, so I'm gonna be critiquing a little hard today. Honestly, some of the guys look confident, some of them look a little antsy. I honestly could not tell you whose plate is whose right now. All right, we're gonna start with this beautiful piece of abstract art right is, here. Is that Cinnamon Toast Crunch? It is Cinnamon okay. Toast Crunch. Mm. <laughs> so the first dish is questionable. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, um I like the strawberry decoration. Whomever made it. All right, let's move on to the next one. Oh my next. god. Yeah, I don't, I can't what even touch this. I'm over there. We're moving on. <laughs> we have, Franny said it was hella dry. Franny was just making the most faces with my stuff. And I was like, whew, good thing she doesn't know it's me. This one, this one looks amazing. This one looks pretty. This one. great. When the plates are side by side, I gotta admit, mine's looking pretty good right now. Hopefully what I got off is enough. The decoration is on point for this one. This is definitely better than the first plate of French toast. I like it. I like this one. Good. I like it. I don't know yeah. mm. Mm. I like We got more French toast. Could have used some more sugar. Apple was a good touch, though. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll give them that. Okay. All right. Third this one. one looks promising. This one Third looks one. so promising, so. I am so confident in how my French toast came out. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this one. This is good. good. This is good. This is really good. There's a lot of syrup, which I love. And overall, it just, so far, is the best one. Okay, let's talk about this. I'm like tired of talking about Vince, okay? I can't wait till Neza chooses me so I can stop hearing about this guy, man. Vince is the better cook. May not be the better man, but definitely the better cook. This one is really pretty. Okay. The rose. I like the flower touch. <laughs> I need the metal pot, that was burnt. <laughs> Mine too. Mine is really burnt. It kind of tastes weird in the middle. Yeah, it's not really my vibe. I'm never gonna cook for Brandon. She is a critic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it tastes a little odd. There was a... Look at me! So, first question, easiest question. Which one was your favorite? That one. This one for sure tasted the best. I just want to actually taste it good with the apple. That's I, what I was that was just kind of the apple was a little thick. It's a little thick. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little thick. <laughs> it's a little thick. <laughs> this one was like a good size. Mm -hmm. size fits in your mouth. That one was very dry. <laughs> and this was a no. That one was dry as hell. This one was a little burnt. <laughs> I think we can all agree that the winner of this challenge, challenge is, is that, that one. one. no surprise to me that Vince won the cooking challenge because he has mentioned to me that he loves to cook. Thank you so much, Christian, for helping us out with this challenge. And thank you to the boys for attempting this challenge. <laughs> We're gonna take the girls up to the room. And have and a girl powwow yeah. with, with Christian. with us. Go oh, great. Girl powwow. <laughs> Do you guys have any questions about the boys? Like, did you vibe with any of them? Um, I vibe the most with Denzel. And he's funny, too. Like, he, oh, he has a Christian. very charming, funny Christian. spirit about we him. We went on a double date with the brothers. Ooh. It yep. was the, <laughs> found the funniest, funniest thing. It was pottery class. It's, it's interesting, because you, you both have, like, one guy who's yeah. just very outgoing and very fun. It's so weird. And that's the brothers. It, and then you have a guy that's very, like, introspective and more mm -hmm. thoughtful. So after meeting all these four guys, I feel that, you know, whoever Franny or Neza end up with, they have four guys here who are very respectful, very fun, and very caring. So I think whoever they choose, they're gonna end up happy.